Hey guys, it's Kelsey. Today I am actually in Cancun, Mexico. I am at the Rio Palace Cucolcan Resort. It is brand new. It's only been open like a week. So we are here on vacation and I thought I would do a quick tour and review to give you, to give you guys an idea of what the resort is like. So I'm outside obviously right now in front of it, but let's go inside and check it out. guys so I'm inside the resort this is just the main entrance area as you can see there's this cool metal I don't know what you would call that but it looks pretty cool um, to the right of me is your check-in area or reception area and then back over this way to the left is a bar but as you can see um, Really nice, I mean, it's brand new, so really modern decor. Yeah, but anyway, so this is kind of like the main area when you first come in, but let's go check out the rest of the resort. So from the lobby, we're gonna head out to the restaurant, which some people think is the most important part of the resort. Not me, but follow me. So I am outside by the restaurant area. There are five restaurants, and then the main restaurant, which is like the buffet. There's Japanese, steakhouse, Italian, fusion, and Mexican. So pretty much anything that you could want is here. This is Restaurante Don Julio. This is the buffet. There's an outdoor seating area and also an indoor seating area. Obviously, I'm outdoors overlooking the ocean, of course, which is why you're here, I hope, to check out the ocean. Hey guys, I am back inside the lobby, the opposite of where we first started. As you can see, there's a bar here, and then on the other side of it, there's like a pastry bar, and I actually tried the macaroons yesterday, and they were really good, so I recommend those. All right, so from here, let's go check out the gym and the spa. All right, so I am in the gym. As you can see, um, brand new equipment, of course. Um, lots of things to choose from. There's free weights, lots of different machines. It's cool in here, so um, a great place to work out. Also, there is a gift shop and professional photos if you're into that. All right, so from there, we are gonna head to the entertainment area, right this way. Right now, it looks like football is on. 
but at night they do a, a different theme every night. Last night it was mariachi, tonight I'm actually not sure, but a different theme, some inter form of entertainment every night. This way to the lounge bar. So I was on my way to the sky bar and I found this. It looks like this is going to be like a shallow pool walkway that you can walk from the corridor to the bar, but this has only been open a week. So for some reason it's not filled yet, but anyway, it looks kind of cool. I thought I would check it out, but let's go to the bar. All right, so here we are at the lounge bar. It's really nice because you have awesome views as you can see overlooking the ocean and let's go in. Okay, so I've just left the main area and I'm headed through this beautiful corridor and we are gonna check out the pools and then most importantly, the beach. So as you can see, it's fully landscaped. Everything looks like it's been here for quite some time. Um, again, this is a brand new resort, so looks really pretty. Okay, so I am outside by the pools. There's actually four pools. One of them has a swim up bar, which is very important. And then there's also an outdoor grill right behind me. So we'll check that out and then we'll head to the beach. So we are leaving the pool area, headed to the beach to check it out. So I'm here on the beach. The whole reason I came, um, as you can see, nice, beautiful sand area. As you can also see, the ocean is very ferocious today. It's quite windy and actually this side of the hotel zone is naturally more wavy than the other side anyway, but with the wind it's just extra aggressive today and the water is a bit cold, which I wasn't really expecting that. The la I generally come to Mexico in the summer so I'm very used to the warm uh, water and this is actually a bit cold. So that was kind of a surprise, um, but it is beautiful. I mean, the color, it's quite beautiful.
I wanted to show you a room. This is the basic room that you can get here at the resort. It is the junior suite with the courtyard view. One thing I like is the card to get in. You don't have to insert it or anything, you just tap it. All right, so upon coming in, you can see um, kind of the theme of the rest of the resort. A lot of marble, a lot of dark woods. Got your toilet over here. Um, two vanities here. Walk-in shower. It says push, so you probably should do that. <laughs> Pretty spacious in there. Now the tub is kind of like in the middle of the room and that might seem weird, but I've actually stayed at other resorts where it was exactly like this. And I'm just happy to have a tub. Not all rooms have the shower and the tub and I like having a bathtub. But anyway, come along. Um, there's an area for your luggage, TV of course, bed, sitting area. And here is the balcony. Now remember this is the, it's locked. This is the courtyard view, so unfortunately, there's no ocean view here, but come on out and check it out. I mean, there is, if you turn a bit, there's definitely the ocean there, so. One more thing to mention, important, mini bar um, does come with your liquor up there and it's fully stocked and they will fill it with whatever you want. And that is about it. So again, this is the junior suite courtyard view. So this is the basic room that you can get here at the Rio, but it's still pretty nice. Okay guys, I've shown you pretty much everything here at the resort, restaurants, spa, gym, pools, the ocean, of course. I hope it's helpful if you were thinking about possibly coming. Honestly, the only um, con I could see is just the rough waters. And again, it has to do with the fact that it's pretty windy today, but also just this side of the hotel zone is just kind of more rough. So if you really are into the ocean, I might stick to the other side, but other than that, the resort itself is really beautiful. And so far, I really enjoyed it here. Um, again, thank you for watching. And if you wouldn't mind liking and subscribing, that would be wonderful. Uh, adios.